We first told you about Towson University launching a new interdisciplinary doctoral program in autism studies back in April. Now that program has a new home on campus, a place that will help Towson lead the way in the field of autism research. And Caroline Forback is on this story for us tonight, giving us an inside look at the new Institute for Well-Being and the work that is being done over there. And I'm pleased to welcome you to the new home of our Institute for Well-Being. Wednesday, Emma Shipley listened to remarks at Towson University's ribbon cutting ceremony for the Institute of Well-Being's new and improved location on York Road, a place Shipley spends a lot of her time. It is completely updated and innovative for the purposes of providing health care services to the community. WJZ first met Shipley in April when the IWB was still housed at one Olympic place in downtown Towson. Shipley, a pathologist at Towson's Speech and Language Center, had just applied for Towson's new PhD program in autism studies. Drawing from her background in the arts, Shipley wanted to continue researching how improv theater could help people on the spectrum with communication skills and confidence. It targets all of the things that speech pathologists and even other therapies target clinically in a context that is fun. The PhD program is now in its first semester at the new IWB location, which houses the Hearing and Balance, Speech and Language and Occupational Therapy Centers, as well as the Hussman Center for Adults with Autism, allowing scholars like Shipley to interact with neurodivergent participants and help them through their research. Shipley was able to host her improv program at the new location over the summer. So by the end of the program, they're a lot more independent and confident in their skills compared to where they were on day one. You can find a link to more information about the IWB on our website, wjz.com. Reporting in Towson, Caroline Forback, WJZ.